Hold on, let me let me find mine. Oh, I see it. Throw to the island first, and you just have to make it on the island somewhere. But if you don't make it on the island, then you actually take a stroke, and then you go stand on that pedestal of shame over the there. Rock. The rock. Okay. Yeah. Ready? You're gonna be standing on the pedestal of shame. Yeah, I know. Shame. Shame. Oh, that's not far enough. Shame. 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 Uh, oh, that's coming back. Oh wait. It's in space! No, no, <laughs> no. Shame. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't, I can't handle this. I can't from? handle this. Oh. oh my gosh. What, what is this? What is this? Oh my gosh. <laughs> come here. <laughs> what? Where did y'all come from? Where did y'all come from? Oh, there's a, there's a house right here. Where did y'all come from? But seriously. <laughs> 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 that thing's gone. <laughs> okay, don't throw it that hard. <laughs> Thank you.
Brady, go! Hi, Brady. Hi, Buzz. Oh, Buzz, stop limping. Hi, Buzz. Hi, Buzz. Hi, Buzz. Where are you going? Oh. Oh. No. Oh. <laughs> That's not quite what we were. Oh, is he peeing? What? Oh, you pee a little. What? <laughs> hey, don't record that. <laughs> <laughs> are you all ready to go for a walk? All right, Brady, let's go. Come on. Come on. Wait, wait. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Come Brady. Here. Come here. Hey. How are we supposed to put your harness on? Look, Buzz is ready to go. Fine, let's go. Come on. Wait, come here. Come. Get over here. <laughs> I think I think that he thinks it's helpful. Brady, come on. Let's go. Wait, let's go. Come on. Over here. Let's go. Come here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> come here. <laughs> come here. Come. Oh my gosh. Brady, we can't go on a walk if you don't have your harness on. Okay, come on. Wait, come. Oh, Brady, come here. Over here. Over here. Come on. <laughs> oh my gosh. Come on, Brady. Come on. For reals, though. For come here. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. No. Ah, I'm really trying to get it on you this time. Yeah, good luck. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. Oh, good boy. Go, Harry! <laughs> so, stay. Stay. Ready? Go! Good job, Lear. Good job. You did so good. Welcome to the video guys. Of course you've already been watching it for a few minutes. Hopefully you all enjoyed the footage of the disc golf course. We wanted to chat with you guys so we have a trip coming up and this is going to be our first big trip with the RV. We don't know what we're doing by Small the way. Small ones here and there. Yeah. Big trips are uh, there's a lot of expectations that we have that I don't know if we're gonna be able to meet. You know what I mean? So it's uh, a lot of things like we know where we want to go. We haven't necessarily made the reservations to be there. So that's kind of a, it's been kind of weighing on us a little bit. Because of that, it's kind of changed our plans a little bit. So we might even stay in one area uh, with uh, near her, uh, some of her family. And that's kind of neat. Like, we're not just going to be staying in one spot the entire time. We're actually going to be jumping around a little bit. And so uh, there's also a little bit more adventure with that. Hopefully that's at least more entertaining for you guys. Um, <laughs> it's going to be definitely entertaining for us, probably pretty stressful for us. But the first week it's going to be in one spot, kind of southern Colorado. The next spot is going to be, um, like we said, Colorado Springs. We'll be in that area. Not exactly sure which part of it, or maybe we can't even stay within Colorado Springs. It might be right outside. But another thing we're going to end up doing... Um, we're going to use this thing, an app. It's not really an app. It's a web-based application. Trip Wizard? RV Trip Wizard. RV Trip Wizard. I can't remember who had commented, but they said that, hey, you guys need to look into this site. I used it for my trip to, like, all across the country, and he said I planned it down to my gas station stops. And that was something that intrigued me because I... Again, we don't even... We don't know what, what we're doing. <laughs> so <laughs> if we can have, like checkpoints along the way or just have a map of all of the places to stay which it already does so we've been calling places um, in the areas that we want to stay and they have them all listed they have it listed whether it's good sam or if there's a discount for triple a um so so far it's really cool um we haven't been able to plan anything yet because we're still working on where we're gonna stay but from there i think you can add in your stops so we want to stop at like a walmart and boondock or just make the rest of the random trip up. points of interest, but really the, the big thing for me, I like the gas station thing because it lets you know, like you can say, I'm starting my trip with X amount of gas, and it'll say, I don't want to go below X amount of gas or Y if we're, if we're throwing in different variables. So say you get down to a half a tank, and you're and that's your your threshold. Like I want to stop for gas. It'll tell you the nearest acceptable gas station for you, and it'll tell you right where it is. Supposedly, I, we haven't actually mapped it all out yet, so okay. we're still working through that process. Um, also, to continue with the trip plans, so most of it's going to be spent in Colorado Springs. Another part 
is either just going to be us leaving the trailer somewhere and then driving up to meet my parents either for the day or a couple days. Um, obviously, the boys are going to go with us no matter what. After that, I think we might even be meeting your brother up there. Yeah, I don't know. There's a lot of things that are up in the air. Yeah, they just kind of started being <laughs> thrown at us. Like, yeah, because there's, uh, you know, we're into climbing and there's a bouldering championship or competition. I what, how do you want to look at it? It's the World Cup, but there's multiple World Cup. Yeah. Yeah. So that's going on in Vail, and so we'll actually be in the area, and so why not? It's like the biggest competition for that. All the all the pros are going to be there. It's just going to be neat to go see. Uh, we've always watched it, and it doesn't come on TV, so it's like you have to really try and watch it. So it's like we're pretty interested. So might as well go. That's the beginning of June. Uh, so that's up in the air as well. So, you know, we can't really plan like what we're going to do because we don't know exactly where we're going to be yet. And I think that's part of what we what we do just in general. We just kind of plan on the fly. And I think that it's helpful because we learn more important lessons that way. <laughs> and yeah. then we can share that with you guys and let y'all know, hey, don't make this mistake or hey, this worked for us. Who knows what's going to happen on this trip. Um, and so that's kind of the fun of it. But that's also sort of the inspiration for further trips after that. So um, we're going to get all the bugs worked out on this trip and y'all can come along of course and then uh, we'll see what happens on the next trip but let's get through this one first another thing is we have a few check boxes that we're trying to check off uh, so we're trying to change insurances right now for the RV uh, we're trying to get the truck registration in before we leave we've you know sent it in uh, a while back and just kind of waiting for it we're trying to get this thing inspected and registered um, some people were telling us we don't have to, but we're going to do it just because I also know the guy over there that's going to be inspecting it. He can take a look at all the tires, just make sure everything's working properly. And there's a few other things, like I don't think we're going to get to the the drone certification, so you're probably not going to see drone footage. We're probably going to take drone footage. I'm still going to take drone footage, but we're not going to show it on a monetized video, so we're going to have to kind of play around with that a little bit. So Yeah, so we've been um, working on getting his certification or whatever it is. Um, because right now you are certified as a hobbyist flyer, but if we right. do want to put it in monetized videos or things that further the channel, it can't be monetized, but then I don't want to not use it, so maybe the drone footage will be later. I'm not sure. Yeah. We're figuring that out, too. <laughs> yeah, and I've talked to photographers that use drones, and they say, don't worry about it. They say, just do, do the footage and use it, but that's just not us. No. No, I think that's most of it. Uh, there's probably some things that I forgot as far as, like, the check, but there's so many checks that mm -hmm. we have to do both on you know my job uh you know everything for the channel and then just the general checks for the rv and everything so that's a uh, lot lots going on yeah lots. yeah when we have a week and a half to do it all so so here we go uh, i think that's gonna be it for today's video um i'm sure we'll be chatting with you guys more about things that come up i do have one for friday coming up and it's some workout footage mm -hmm. and a little like grocery haul so yeah you guys stay tuned for that i know it's been a while since we did a fitness friday video but we got one coming so okay so okay make sure and thumbs up if you're excited for the trip and we always look forward to y'all's feedback in the comments below that's been one of the best things about youtube is making friends with you guys and having your professional opinions <laughs> professional than Experience. ours. Experience. <laughs> we'll pass that on to everybody else. So. Yeah. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And that's, yeah, that's it. Cool. Well, have fun out there. Bye, guys.